So, Mickey, another pre-season, another game for you under your belt as well. How do you feel personally? I'm all right. Um, so I was going to really struggle tonight, to be honest, um, fitness-wise. Um, but no, I felt all right. My groin was really sore over the weekend from Friday. Um, but it's eased off um, the last couple of days and I managed to manage myself through the game. So, um, like, I see, I, like I said on Friday, I'd rather um, me bang the minutes in and risk getting injured myself than the likes of Chris Thackeray or, or somebody else getting injured. So, um, yeah, just um, I'm feeling all right, to be fair. And some more minutes for everyone else on the pitch as the squad's starting to come together a little bit, do you think? Yeah, um, starting to get... You know, a lot more minutes into them. Um, games sort of Saturday, Tuesday, you know, Friday, Tuesday. So um, that's what we're going to be having during the season. So we're just trying to get them um, equipped for the season and, and get them used to having to recover. You know, big emphasis on them recovering between the games and, and how they look after themselves when they're not with us. Um, and, you know, I think judging by the, the fitness tonight, um, I think they're, they're starting to take that on board. And you can see the difference already from the first game against Heaven last week to now. Has it really impressed you how the lads have adapted so quickly? It has, yeah. Um, I said them before the game. I, I wasn't, um, I wasn't too down after after Heaven. There was, there was some really good, really good parts to the game, um, especially our pressing. Um, and I, you know, I took the positives out of it. Was it a good result? No, of course it wasn't. Was it a great performance? No, but. There was parts of it, part of it in there where we were happy with. Um, we took the, the good parts of that, took them into Dunstan. Um, you know, could have could have won comfortably uh, at Dunstan, so we stepped up, and then we knew it was going to be a step up tonight. Um, we had a, a really poor 15, 20 minutes. Um, they went three up, um, and could have could have quite easily just kept kept going. You know, we could have folded. We got a lot of young lads in there who who could have. Um, could have just turned the backs, hid, and you know it could have went four, five, and six. But credit to them, they didn't. Um, thought the older lads, more experienced lads on the pitch, pulled together. Um, thought Heslock was brilliant, and Robbie Deal, um, and sort of pulled them in, pulled them round. And um, once we sort of rode that period out, and we had a, a good five minutes and got the ball in their half and started playing a little bit more. I think you see the the lads growing confidence, um, and I don't think it would have been too bad if we'd have, if we'd have sneaked an equaliser or or a little bit more. Um, we had some some good breakaways second half. Um, don't get us wrong, they had chances as well, but um, yeah, we could have got something out of the game. But I said to them in there afterwards, it's I'm I'm not bothered about the result. Um, I feel we've stepped up again. Um, it's definitely a step up in opposition from from Dunstan. No no disrespect to them, but. Morpeth have got a much bigger budget and, a, and a, a, a better side in my opinion so it was a, a tougher test and I think we did well. Mm -hmm. And the side's looking a lot more organised now, is that something you've worked on a lot in training? Um, yeah, in the in the sessions we've had. Um, we haven't trained a lot since we started the pre-season game, we haven't trained at all since we started the pre-season games, it's just been game after game so credit to the lads that they've had to take on board what we've um, talked through and what we've shown them on the tactics board. We haven't been able to get on the grass and, and walk through stuff. Um, we're going to see how they react, and we'll probably bring them in Thursday and, and do a little, a little cool down and just walk through some stuff on the pitch, um, ready for Saturday. Um, but no, no real heavy stuff. Um, but yeah, they're taking things on board. Um, very receptive, um, and just uh, full of praise for them really for for what they've done. Um, but they've just got to keep going. Told them, you know, they can't just improve and then think they've they've cracked it and and think that they've, they've got to the level and that that's enough mm -hmm. they've got to strive to be better every game they play mm -hmm.